like these can this has been this video because these are like what my favorite shoes ever and i feel like i'm a fashion student in these look, shoes let's make a video i hope ah cubes falling okay oh uh, look i had to write some crap on my hand look i had to write things on my hand so i remember and i do it and then i forgot and i couldn't get money out okay Sarah. no why do i look so white okay this is Assalamu alaikum, hey everybody. So I'm here with Molly. Hi. And we thought we'll do a favourite makeup video, which we've been planning to do for oh so long. And we're here now. I hope this is in focus. I don't have my remote. Okay. Uh, okay. Who's going to go first? Okay, do you want to introduce yourself? Talk about yourself. Hi, I'm Molly. Um, I live in Birmingham. And... <laughs> I don't mean that. Can you introduce yourself? What I mean, like, what you do. Molly's just started doing makeup. Oh yeah. I look fat today. I just started doing makeup and I'm only really on Instagram. Molly's makeup addiction. In the description box below. Yeah. So yeah, um, do you want to start first? Because you know you're the guest. Technically I'm the guest today. But... Yeah, you. Okay, go on. Place. But you know you're guest on my channel. Go on. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to start with primer because I do that and do foundation. Basically, this primer is the bomb it's not in focus you can just focus like that just have it here it's the bomb.com it's basically nivea daily express hydrating primer and it's really really good and it's really really cheap uh, i've used the ilamasca hydrovel and i totally totally prefer this over that and the hydrovel is like 26 pounds and this is like four pounds and it's so much better but you need to make sure you apply a really really thin layer I, I want to talk about that as well. She don't like it. I really don't like it. It doesn't work for my skin. And I think if you have dry skin, even though that is for dry skin, yeah, you, kinda, hydrating. you have to be careful because I find that my make, my foundation looks really cakey and really patchy. But then when I don't use that, my foundation is good. So with my skin, I can't use primer because it makes my foundation look horrible. So if your foundation looks bad, it might be the primer and don't use a primer. Yeah. Do you not use a primer? Not at all. It's the That's why my foundation looks flawless because I don't use it, the oh, primer. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not big headed, I promise. Okay, I'm going to talk about. Oh, I think. Well, since we started off with face. Yeah. No, I'm going to talk about my favourite product. My most favourite. It's amazing. It's my holy grail at the moment. And it's the Givenchy mascara. Oh my god. Like this. How long have you had it? I've only had it a couple of days. Like a week? Five days? Already? It's so, like, my eyelashes, okay. I've got to say the wand is cool. The wand is cool, it's literally three balls. Anyway, <clears throat> so, it's amazing. <laughs> so, yeah, it's amazing. It's just, it's so good, and I only need to use this. I don't need anything else. My eyelashes look so good, and, like, right in my eyes. And they're so long, and they're not actually that long, and they, like, I don't know if you Yeah, your eyelashes are long, I've seen you. They're, they're not long, long, but then with this mascara, they look humongous. Today they're not that good because I didn't spend that much time, but yeah. Okay, go on, your turn now. Okay, um, next thing is setting spray. We both love. We both love this. This is the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. I'm actually not wearing it today, I think. I think I forgot to put it on. Spray if you want. Um, I've used the MAC one, Fix Plus, and no, this is amazing. I like to spray it before my makeup as well because it makes it last so much longer. Like I can do my makeup at 7 a.m. in the morning and at 10 p.m. it's still on because I've sprayed this a few times. It's amazing. It's an investment and you should get it. It's amazing. Also, if you guys can't, if you're like, don't want to spend, how much is it? £23? You can... £20. You can, pound. £20. 20 pound. That's actually not too bad. You can get the smaller version, which is like 12 yeah. or 17 And it lasts really long. And I've it lasts for ages. ages ages and i sprayed like tons on my face i agree okay the next thing which i've only had for a while again but i absolutely love and it's and this was recommended by tatty and it's the cargo you can't get this in the uk i actually got this from tk maxx it's the cargo bronzer blusher what is this oh this is parisian oh so it's called hydro bronze and this is amazing and it's a really really it's nice color and what i love about it is it blends so well like it blends really really well you have like a problem with contouring because you're so fair so yeah and i like, do it too dark it. and then like you know when i go to makeup counters they're like you should tone it down a bit <laughs> but I if like, anyone ever told me to tone down my makeup i'll be like and i'm just like I love it like that and the brush that I like, I hate real techniques but this brush is amazing. Like I go in with my 
contour like that and then I go with this and then I blend it out and this brush is amazing and I really want to find another brush like this because it's so good. Talking of brushes, NARS brush. Okay, these two can do the same thing. This is £26 and this is... It's in a, in a pack set of, though. Comes in a pack of five. It annoys me that it's in a set. And it's like £20. Everyone raves about this. I think because it's so so easy it's easy to like use. literally it's like, all right. you do is that and you've got the best contour ever but if you know how to contour how to contour I and how this. to use your brushes can you i buy can this off you buy it off me it's really hard to to find it's they, always no, sold out. it's always sold out that's why i'm like can i buy it off but you? you can do what you do with that with this i know but i'm not that good at contouring if you know how to hold a brush i know how to hold but it's too much effort in the morning i could just be like I should make my own brush. Yeah, it's like it takes it's it's like takes like two seconds and it's amazing. I I didn't know like it goes in like that. Yeah, the brush is really. Oh my god, look, it's like that. Yeah, it's, it's it doesn't look like it's greatly put together, but it does work really well. And the I don't like the bristles. Like the bristles are really thin, but I think that is because they're it's quite, to, it's so that you don't have a harsh contour, and that's why it's so easy. It's not densely packed at all. That's true. Is it my turn now? Yes. Next, I'm going to talk about, I'm going to put these two together because it's very similar and I have quite a lot of stuff compared to you. Yeah. Um, the mo at the moment, I'm loving, loving like light foundations and the YSL foundation, what's this? It is Touche Clap and I love it. It's amazing. I am currently in shade BD40. It's a bit dark for me. But for some reason, I always look so white on camera. Why do I look so... I hate being white. Are you wearing it now? Yeah, this is what I wear, from, like, all the time. Well, Love you it. Are... All right. Not you can't tell on camera, though. I still look bloody white. Okay. And the next thing is the Tushy Clat YSL. I mentioned this in my favourites video, but I have to mention it again. It's amazing. I do have shade 2, which is a little dark for me, but it'll do. And it works really well. It's just amazing. It's amazing. And I love... I'm currently really into light foundations and stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna go on to lips. Along with these three. Okay. These are the Revlon Color Burst Matte Balms, and I've got three shades, and I really, really, really like them. They they're a bit like not minty, but yeah, they they have a minty yeah, taste. Yeah, like it's a bit weird, but I think they're really good, especially the red one. I think it's great and. Should I just swatch them on my hand? Yeah, you as well. I think the colour oh, is amazing. The red isn't red though, it's pink. It's, yeah, it's red. It's not red, it's red. Pink. So that's 250 and then there's 230 which I just bought recently, I which really is really good. I to get that. And then the one that everyone's got. I have that. 205. It's such an amazing... It's basically, you know what colour th this one is? It's... The MAC one, it's... Oh man, I have it, I have it. It's my favourite pink one. I mentioned it in my favourite lipsticks. Come on. I think if you're gonna buy one, definitely go for like that one or that pink one. one. The pink one or the nude one because you can mix them, whereas the red you can't really do that much with them. But like that one I've bought recently and I love it so much. It's yeah. Like oh and it's it's just always you can always it looks wear such it. Like, such a nice car. I need to get yeah, that. It's lovely. Okay. Um okay, speaking of lips, at the moment my favourite lipstick is this brown one i love brown lipsticks i'm such an old person everything like i wear grandma's clothes i like grandma lipsticks so and this grandma is Nabila. yeah you know this is revlon as well and this is in six seven one mink and it's amazing i love it do you know what i like the formula of revlon lipsticks they're amazing they're really they're so nice. i've got one but i forgot to bring it that's we'll what do. it looks like i love it i love brown lipsticks and this suits anything i wear like it really goes and it looks nice and i look so sophisticated and older and nice. i really like it it's i'm really gonna nice get that you should it's really nice okay lips again i want to try that <laughs> gerard cosmetics uh 1995 lipsticks that jacqueline hill yeah. designed with them Ooh. and you swatch it on your hand um it's really nice it the consistency <gasps> I is i need this color yeah it's it smells it smells like cinnamon it's cinnamon yeah. That's weird, no small lipstick like this. Sorry, keep cleaning up. <laughs> it's okay. Um, it's good lipstick. It, it's affordable. I got it um, at a discounted price because I used a voucher code that, a discount code that Goss Makeup Artist had. Is it? Yeah. Is it and just me or is it the lipstick like that? Yeah, it's like that. That's what, the consistency is a, it's just a bit. 
It's like there's breadcrumbs in there. Yeah. It's That's what like, my lipsticks look like after I've eaten. Yeah. <laughs> That's the only thing that I don't like about it, but the colour is really nice. It's obviously the Sorry. Kylie Jenner look. Lip. Yeah, I like it. I've got is of is it this what she back. actually? This is probably what she wears. Oh no, she wears Mac, doesn't she? She mixes yeah. Mac. Kylie Jenner. Yeah. I I need to get. Can you order color. this one for me? Yeah. My birthday. Okay. Can I have it early though, please? When's your birthday? October what? Twenty nine. All right. Can I have it next week? <laughs> no. <laughs> Takes longer than that to get here. Oh yeah. Oh, it's, go on. Uh, um, Mac Factor lip pencil. Uh, what's the shade? Oh, I was looking everywhere for this mauve it. moment. I couldn't find like it is really nice. I need shopping it. Oh, oh my! Don't God. you see what? Like it's the perfect lip pencil to go with. Uh, yeah. Nineteen ninety five. It's so lovely, but no, it's not the perfect one. It needs to be a bit darker. But yeah, see, I like these oh, colors. That's just it's so beautiful. I love this. I need to get both of them. Okay, my next favorite is I have two: a hit and a miss. The hit is the Maybelline Brow Drama. I love this. This is amazing. I, I really like it. Like if you wanna, if you're in a rush, you just literally put this on your eyebrows like this, and you're done. Bad thing is the wand. Are you doing like? Is this a mascara wand? It's so fat. I end up my brows look a bit weird, but obviously I have to work around it. Do you know what? I don't like it. I don't think it's got enough color in it. Yeah, but I've the just color. realized that you have light brows. I think I have, and light I brows. have dark brows. That's why. It so works that's why. For me. And I like light brows, so it works for me. I like dark, I've got dark brows. Anyway. And then the miss is this, and I hate this. This is disgusting. It's the Rimmel, um Brow This Way Styling Brow Gel. I love, love, love the wand. Like I think it's the perfect size, like this. And this is. An obvious dupe for the benefit brow whatever it's brow. called so yeah and but I don't know if you can see it's so clump it's so clumpy and when you put it on so much product goes onto your brows and it just does not look good and I've tried to work with it and the color is so unrealistic it's like can you see that whose brows are this color I don't know if you can see it's yeah. like it's like a chocolate it's like a milk yeah. chocolate brown nobody's brows are that color it's just the colors are not good and yeah, go on your turn. Oh, let's talk about the palette that we both love. With the, the last this? one. Okay. I love this, and I mentioned this in my favourites video. Okay, so this is the Makeup Revolution um, I Love Makeup Death by Chocolate palette. Just open it for you. And as I mentioned in my favourites video, that's a dupe for the Too Faced Chocolate, chocolate palette. palette. And it actually smells like chocolate as well. I actually smelled it. They do two versions of this. One's called Death by Chocolate, and really? the other one's called Love Chocolate. Yeah, there's two versions. We didn't realise when we went. Uh, <laughs> what is she doing? She she just she's thinks so that pretty, music. mashallah. Oh, she's alright. <laughs> um, ah, my legs. <laughs> what she doing? Anyway, yeah. Um, it's really pigmented and it's so affordable and it's really. I love the colours. The colours are amazing. I use it every. Today's the only day since I bought it that I haven't used it because wow. I was a bit late. It is really good. It's a really lovely palette. It's amazing. Okay. Oh, I've got pins and needles. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. I do well. I can't move. Okay. Do we need to say more? I mean, I love NARS. The packaging is just amazing. So, um, this is the powder foundation in light one Siberia. I have the giggles. What? <laughs> no, I've got pins and needles. <laughs> She's got them. That's why I have the giggles. <laughs> Okay, okay, so it looks like this. I've, you know what, most of these products I talked about in my favourites video. Maybe I should not upload my favourites video. So it looks like this. I love this. This is the only powder. I've tried all every, probably every single powder out there. This is the only powder that does not make me look flaky. And it's good for... Flake is good for dry skin and good for oily skin. Only problem is it's too light. And, the dark, and then the shade up is too dark. So... Nars, you need to step up your game and make a shade for me, please, because I love it. It's just so good. Do you not like the Rimmel one that everyone talks about? That what? makes, oh my god, it makes my skin look so bad. I don't even like to powder. But I hate powdering and this is the only thing that lets me powder, but I have a very, I have very oily skin. Yeah, you do. It's And especially if I wear loads of foundation, not loads, but when I have more coverage it's foundation, enough, yeah. then it just doesn't, doesn't look good. Okay, go on. Okay, I like the Barry M. Um, Never tried it. Barry M Brow Kit. I think it's really good. They, it comes, there's three little things in it. It's um, like a wax uh, brown oh, powder. Oh, they're all too dark for me. Oh, uh, yeah, brown powder. I've got dark brows. Well, 
Asian Pakistani. The thing is, you can get away with it because I don't know. See, when you when you're like dark, a little bit tanned, you can have darker brows. Yeah, there we go. And um, like it just. Yeah. But when you're really fair, like me, especially camera, it just I look so weird. I think it's really good. It's really affordable, and it's worth getting if. You know, you don't want to spend fortune on something like. What's this? Is this the I never wear that. I never wear the highlight. I always the highlight use the is so dark. Yeah, it's not. I don't think it's great, but get it if you don't want to spend money. On How brows. much is it? Do you know? It's like a couple of quid, four or five maybe, something like that. Try it out if you guys are interested. My next thing is I've really been into nail polishes, and everybody. Oh my god, people just need to calm down with the nail polish. You know, I had a comment. I was reading it yesterday, and they're like. And I was, I was basically opening a Quran and I was showing them because I was sent one and they were like, oh my god, you wear nail polish, why are you touching it? And I'm like, babes, you do realise you can touch things if you have nail polish on. Like, I'm wearing nail polish for the sake of the video, can I just add? Like, I put the nail polish on before I film and I get the train, so I do my nail polish on the train. I mean, like, I don't understand why people don't get that. Like, seriously, man, use your heads a bit. <laughs> not being rude like i'm okay i shouldn't talk my mind anyway i've been loving <laughs> i shouldn't talk my mind <laughs> i've i've been loving this barrier matte now um polish it's amazing it's beautiful it's like this and it just it, it gives look good. it looks so good and it looks so even i'm never wearing polish polish. It looks so good. i've only you recently know started tired. Tired. you know why you know why i actually wear it it's because i do fashion is it not? i do fashion and you know if you use pins and stuff your nails get so manky so like you actually have to paint your nails or they'll all just look horrible so Can keep you like them tools? strong yeah I, I shape them i really love my nails um but yeah, that's that. Okay, um, next palette. Ooh, I can't find Stila anywhere, you know. It's not, um, like, gone from Boots. It's still there. I went to check because I was, like, In commentary, they still I was it. mortified when you said they don't do it anymore. I was like, no. I couldn't find it. I went to check and they still do it. Um, in Birmingham Boots one, they only sell two palettes. This one, which is called In the Light, and another one, which I think is called something Garden. Can't remember. But, oh my god. They're like the easiest eyeshadows Ooh, ever to blend. I like that colour. They're, they're Everyone, very similar. Anyone who sees this palette loves Bubbly and Kitten, which is the two gold shades, Bubbly and Kitten. Everyone loves them. Oh, I'm not a gold person, but I do like Bubbly. I really like this colour. is probably my... F Bliss and Sunset are probably my... These two. What's great about them is, is they're so, like so they easy to blend. Them. Like They're just so nice and... I'm like trying all her mm. makeup. <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, and it's like twenty five pounds. Um, it's really expensive, but it's okay. I guess it depends. How it's ten eyeshadows, twenty five quid. Not that bad. No, no, it's not bad. It's just because I don't wear eyeshadows, so I'm still getting into it. But yeah, that's cool. You have quite a few palettes. And next thing, I think this is the final thing. Yeah, almost final thing that I'm going to talk about. I thought I'd include this because it is good if you guys are wondering and I did mention it in my whole video so I thought I might as well talk about it because I don't know if I ever will again and it's the Dior Iconic Overcurl Mascara did you know you had that? yes I ended up buying it because I bought this before the Givenchy one and Tati's like it's so amazing blah 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 Ooh, <laughs> you need to watch her she's actually really good Samili. Samili. I already did on, on oh, whatsapp oh, me. <laughs> so yeah um, th the wand is like this only you know what I don't like it d you actually look like you have false eyelashes it's a bit like That's this good. yeah which is good however it's it is very clumpy you would need to go in with another mascara and when when it comes to finding the perfect mascara you don't really want to be using two so I do go in with my favorite L'Oreal one which one do you like from L'Oreal the f my favorite one is false slash architect it's amazing like it's the best mascara ever in terms of like overall, is it the apart from one? yeah, apart oh, from yeah. the Givenchy one, that is like my second favorite mascara, and it's amazing, and I've been recommending it to everybody. So yeah, my favorite um, product of all time, ever. Okay, maybe and, not all time, but oh, I love it so much. It's the MUA Undress Your Skin Shimmer Highlight, and it's in like the pinky shade, which is called. I have that. I should give you my one. CL1 HD. I love it. How do you apply it? 
uh, just with an eyeshadow, fluffy eyeshadow brush um, on the tops of my the cheeks. The little one? Yeah. So you use the little one? That's I use cool. little brush. I can use big one, but little one is it's better because you can control where it goes. And it's just amazing. It's so, oh. so, so good. I can't I just found say try it. <laughs> it's three quid. I mean, three quid really. And it looks so amazing. It's like all over my Instagram. My favourite one is the MAC one. I, I know I know. We're, I'm not supposed to be talking about MAC. But um, no, you see? can get, but you can get a sample, and that's actually how I got mine. But it's because I didn't have it in stock ages ago. I'm sure I was with you. Were we not together? We got I'm shopping sure. Like every week. I'm sure it was with you. So um, I, got, I ended up getting a sample, and they actually give you. I've had mine for months, and it lasts forever. I mean, it's loose, but it's amazing, and it's what I wear. Do you know what's really good? The Bare Minerals Foundation, the new one, the liquid one. I, put, I don't. I don't ever. Put, it's actually really good. I've Some got a sample. Are like, it's not good. Really? I've got a sample and I've tried it and I really, really liked it. Can I buy a sample? Yes, it's done. So good. Okay. Um, anyway, like, this is just amazing. I'd say get it. It's £3 and it makes a huge difference to your face. It just makes you look so much more shivery. I think I, I love my highlighters. I go in yeah. quite, quite heavy handed so with mine. I do love my highlighters. I don't like this one because it gives you too much of a pinky look and they do my skin, my skin's a bit. Oh, I should try the gold one. My it's skin's a bit pinky, and I don't want it to look more pinky. If that makes sense. Next thing that I'm going to talk about. I'm sorry, a lot of your products I actually don't like. Really? Wow. Well, actually, it was just two. Sorry, I'm over exaggerating. <laughs> this thing, um, I actually got. I actually found out about this from Shakila B Palette, who's also a makeup artist. Oh yeah, I know her. Yeah, I she's mean, a friend of mine. Not know her, but. Her son you really follow is them, you so think you know them. adorable, mashallah. So anyway, she uses this smells of my shampoo. She smells nice. So basically, you obviously get shampoo and then you just do this, and it washes your brushes so well. And it's only one pound fifty from Primark. You may try it. I like it. And it's silicone, and to be honest, it's just so nice. It is really nice. Thumbs up. Really, this, and you don't need to spend like I really wanted to get the Sigma one, but it's like forty dollars, or maybe even yeah. fifty dollars, something ridiculous. But um, this is really good. Okay, my thing is my last thing. This I've had this for like a year and a half, maybe, um, and it's like it's so amazing. Who's it from? It's from Coastal Oh, Sense. what you were talking about. And I love it. It's probably the first palette that I've ever bought. I've probably got about a collection of about 20 now. But Really? Yeah, I love, love this palette. It's so amazing. It's a great dupe for Naked 1 and Naked 2. The quality is amazing. They're so pigmented and the colours are great. And you just use How much is it? All the time, £20. I might invest in this. I bought, I think but I how much is the na Naked palette? Isn't it like £30? The Naked palettes are 37 each. But this is Naked 1 Naked 2. Oh. Do you get what I mean? 20 quid, okay. like really. Okay, okay, I get it. <gasps> yes, it is. This is the top Do ones. I, mean? I want the top ones. You don't understand how amazing this palette is. Like, they're so pigmented. And like this colour that Nabila's just put on a finger now is what I always use That's as my transition colour. I do love that as yeah, I use I that as my transition colour. Always use it as my transition colour all the time. I love it. I love it so much. I might I'm probably getting this. It's really good. I'd say get it definitely. Like that and this that. gold is gorgeous. If you're gonna buy anything. This good, yeah. Oh my god, it's yeah. so amazing. Don't you think that's so much like bubbly from Stilla? It is. I want to get this palette, but I hate it's, buying things online. Oh, yeah, I know, oh. but it's definitely worth getting. I don't think people hype about it enough. No, I think they, they don't. They don't hype about that palette. Hyped. There's a second version now. It's got like ruddy tones to it, burgundy. Uh, that it. That's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And oh dear me, I touched my lipstick by accident and i hope you guys enjoyed this talking video if you enjoyed it i just bit my tongue <laughs> i can't talk so if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and stuff and go follow her on instagram she does all sorts of makeup looks and i'll see you in my next video bye you were still so far away from me look i should have sat here because I, I just looked so big yeah but this is like reality yeah no this is reality <laughs> now they say I'm actually so tired. I want to go to sleep now. You should do an outfit video quickly. Might as well film it. Do an outfit video, right? So wearing this scarf. Move. Why are you should have been involved as well? <laughs> oh, okay. I am wearing on my lips. Um, I actually just bought this today. Really? Yep. It's the sh it's the first O1 shade by Rimmel Kate. 
Love it. It's so good. It's amazing. Scarf from Only Hijab, um, which I bought to match my shoes. It's actually really difficult to get this colour scarf, you know. Oh, yeah. I went everywhere. I did not have yeah, this shape. Yeah, you haven't got enough scarf, yeah. And then I got this, which is also, it's a pashmina from Only Hijab. Um, my scarf is from Popular underscore LTD. And I'm wearing just a simple grey dress from Primark. Primark! Of that course. Have. And that's it. And obviously them shoes. Oh my god, this matches my <laughs> outfit today. I'll take that one, show you. It actually, do oh my god, it's it's the same colour like as my scarf. I should, see, I should just wear this like that. And you were saying, where will I wear this? Um, It's my DKNY. Make, it's, I think it's a, is it a makeup bag or, or clutch? It's a makeup bag for it's you. It's a makeup bag for me, obviously. Oh, I think it's a clutch. <laughs> Look what's in here. You don't. I have, I have presents. It's all Is that what you use to kill yourself? Yeah, apparently you can die if you eat these. It but it's not true. <laughs> it's not true because I ate them a couple of times just to check and nothing happened to me. Like, oh, when I was little, when I was like seven, yeah. I, didn't, I didn't die, so clearly you clearly. don't die. Just, just she, put that out there. She, she didn't die, guys. <laughs> As you can tell. Clearly I'm not dead. And um, yeah, this video is like 23 minutes. Is it really? Yeah, it is.